Hi, in this video we will compare these tools step by step. If the video was helpful, please like and subscribe. Gemini is Google's AI chatbot, a direct competitor to ChatGPT and Microsoft Copilot. And the best news, it's free. Google Gemini is more than just a chatbot, it's a flexible productivity tool. You can generate content like drafting a professional email or hold back and forth conversation to refine your ideas. For example, you can write a draft prompt, write an email to a potential client about our new project management software, highlight improved collaboration and task tracking, and end with the call to action. And you can instantly adjust the tone, make it shorter, simpler, more professional, or more casual with just one click. Here's the follow-up prompt. Make it shorter and more professional. And the coolest thing is once you got the result you like, you can listen to it out loud, copy it, share it, or even export it directly to Google Docs for further editing. Gemini can analyze uploaded images using Google Lens and its internal analytics. That means that you can drop a screenshot or a photo, even in a foreign language, and Gemini will describe what's there and translate it for you. For example, you can upload a photo and ask, what's this image about? List everything that you see. Isn't it cool? It understood the image, translated the text, and provided us with the description. Professionals often rely on Gemini as a writing partner. It can help outline blogs, polish resumes, draft emails, or proofread academic papers. The key is context. Be specific about your audience, tone, and goals. Here's the sample prompt. I'm writing a blog post about generative AI. Find and summarize three to five credible sources, then create a detailed outline. And here's a follow-up prompt. Draft a paragraph for the key point section, focusing on the latest NLP advancements. One of the Gemini's most practical features is its integration with Google Workspace. You can analyze docs, sheets, slides, and even generate new Gmail for communication. This removes copy and paste steps and makes workflow seamless. For example, I have this resume on my Google Drive. I can copy the link to the resume and ask Gemini to analyze the resume and provide summary. Because this is my first time connecting to Google Workspace, I will be asked to connect. I'm going to choose connect and you will see the summary of the document. And here are some cool ideas how you can use this integration. For example, I can generate content and export it as Google Docs. Here's the prompt. Draft a one-page project proposal for a new marketing campaign. Include goals, timeline and deliverables. Once the content is generated, I can click the share and export button and export it to Google Docs. Gemini created a new Google Doc and saved it into my drive. You can also generate new content and export it directly to Gmail for sending. Let's start with the prompt. Write an email introducing our new project management software. Highlight collaboration and tracking benefits and end with the call to action. Once content is generated, you can click share and export button and select draft in Gmail. And the new draft email is ready for you in seconds. All you need to do is edit it, make sure this is what you want, type the recipient's email and click send. Let me show you how to use Copilot and Windows effectively, so you can save time, reduce frustration and get more done. You launch Copilot by finding the app through search menu or directly using Windows Start button. Copilot promises a shortcut. You type a question in natural language and it explains what to do. For example, how do I change my screen brightness and text size? And it gives you instructions. You go to Start, Settings, System and Display. Let's try it. Let's launch Settings. We are in System. Let's go to Display. And here under Scale, we can change the text size. I wish I could just type the prompt, change my text size to 175%. But the truth is, Copilot doesn't fix things directly for you. It gives you clear instructions and you still need to take final steps directly yourself. Because of this, you want to treat Copilot as a Windows coach. Let's put Copilot and settings side by side and see what we can do. Now you can ask the question, why is my computer running slow? And you see that Copilot gave you a recommendation to check the task manager for startup apps, run Windows Update or free up disk space. I immediately look at my settings and see that the Windows Update is missing. And after I restart my computer, Windows will run a lot faster. Let me show you some cool Copilot prompts that you can use solving common Windows problems. Keep in mind that with each prompt you can expand even further by asking more questions. Find files I created this week. What's cool about this is that even though Copilot can't change the settings, but it can access the files in your file system. You can control what's allowed in more details in Copilot settings. To see them, navigate in Copilot pane, click on your profile and select settings. You can allow file search, 
and you can allow file read. Choose to make sure which one is the best for you. Are you struggling with too many notifications? Just ask, how do I turn off distracting notifications? Copilot suggests some cool YouTube videos on the topic, as well as provide you specific instructions how to do it. Here are some other cool prompts to use Windows effectively. If you want dark mode or high contrast, just prompt switch to dark mode, and Copilot will guide you through all the steps that you need to do. Here are some other problems you can solve with Copilot. Sound or microphone problems, running out of storage, battery drains too fast, apps freezing or crashing, security worries, multiple monitors not aligned correctly, or accidentally deleted a file. Copilot can guide you how to solve each one of them. And this is just the beginning. 